Marco Panella, born Jacinto Panella, the 2nd of May 1930 to the 19th of May 2016, was an Italian politician, journalist, and activist. He was well known in his country for his non-violence and civil rights campaigns, like the right to divorce, the right to abortion, the legalization of cannabis, and the definitive abolition of nuclear power. Internationally, he supported human rights and self-determination causes, like the Tibetan independence and persecution of Christians in Vietnam. He was the historic leader of the Radical Party the first expression of the radicals in post-World War II Italy was the Italian Radical Party, founded in 1955. Between 1979 and 2009, he was a member of the European Parliament, where he sat as a full member in the Committee on Legal Affairs, in the Committee on Budgetary Control and in the Delegation for Relations with Israel. He was also president of the Nonviolent Radical Party. He's considered an example of left libertarian and liberal socialist. Early life Marco Pinella was born in Taramo Abruzzo from an Italian father and a Swiss mother on 2 May 1930. He attended the classical Lyceum Julius Caesar in Rome. In 1955 Pinella graduated in law at the University of Urbino. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Political career. At 20 years old, Pinella became a national representative at the university level for the Italian Liberal Party (PLI), member of the student association Union Goliardica Italiana (UGI), and at 23 he was president of the Union Nazionale degli Studenti (National Union of Students). At 24 he promoted the foundation of the Partito Radical here and after the Radical Party. From 1960 to 1963, he was in Paris as a correspondent of the Italian newspaper Il Giorno. During his long political career, Pinella co-founded a series of organizations such as the Italian League for Divorce, the League for Objection of Conscience, the League for the Abrogation of the Agreement between the Catholic Church and the Italian State Concordat, the center of legal initiative, Piero Calamandre, as well as the Italian Association for Demographic Education AIED. He has been at the forefront of the promotion of important reforms regarding narcotics and faced incarceration on various occasions for his civil disobediences. He played a prominent role in the movement that led to the legalization of abortion in Italy in 1978. He also promoted actions to grant electoral rights for Italians aged 18, engaged in the defense of civil rights in Eastern European countries. In 1968, he was arrested in Sofia for having distributed leaflets against the communist regime. He was one of the first promoters and founders of the Green and Ecologist political movements in Europe. Over the years, he was engaged in Italy in the defense of civil rights as well as against the public financing of political parties and against corruption of Italian politics. Beginning in the 1970s, Pinella promoted a series of referendums on themes ranging from social to political issues, in particular on those relating to the legality of the state, the rule of law and to the administration of justice. He was elected to the European Parliament in 1979. He sat in the Technical Group of Independents which was a technical alliance of left-wing MEPs who were not allied with either the Soviet-influenced Communist parties or the mainstream Social Democratic parties. He served as chair of the group along with the hardline Irish Republican Neil Blaney and Danish left-wing Eurosceptic Jens Peter Bond. Throughout the 1980s, he promoted international anti-prohibitionist campaigns on drugs and was one of the founders of the Radical Anti-Prohibitionist Coordination and of the International Anti-Prohibitionist League. A believer in Gandhian nonviolence, Pinella carried out several hunger strikes in Italy and elsewhere to defend civil rights and to end extermination through starvation the world over. This included a hunger strike in 2007, to protest against the death penalty. This strike was set off by the hanging of Saddam Hussein. A hunger strike in April 2014 to protest Italian prison conditions resulted in Pinella having to have surgery. A disciple of Altiero Spinelli and Ernesto Rossi, Pinella was one of the first European federalists and fought, through nonviolent means, for the creation of the European Union. He was elected secretary of the Radical Party in November 1981 and remained in office until November 1983. At the RP Congress in Budapest in 1989, he launched the creation of the Transnational Radical Party of which he became president of the Federal Council on that occasion. 
In 2003, he created together with other prominent European personalities the Medbridge Strategy Centre, whose goal is to promote dialogue and mutual understanding between Europe and the Middle East. He was Honorary President of the Party of the Rom in the Czech Republic and he was also Honorary Member of the Socialist Slovene Youth. The Jewish National Fund Hebrew, Kern Quimt Lysarel Karen Kayamet Israel, dedicated him a reforestation area in the Negev Desert in Israel. In October 2011, he became a member of the French Federalist Party in order to take part in the founding convention of the European Federalist Party which took place on 5-6 November 2011. Thus he became a founding member of the European Federalist Party. Topic: Personal life. Panella had never been married and had no children. He had been living for several decades with his girlfriend Marella Parachini. In 2010, he alluded in an interview to the fact that Parachini and he had always been in an open relationship without jealousy. In the same interview, Panella admitted to being bisexual and to having had three or four significant relationships with other men. He was an atheist. Panella died on the 19th of May 2016 of cancer after agreeing to be sedated. The Italian Prime Minister Matteo Renzi described him as a lion of freedom. <laughs> 